This video will show you how to use Mail Merge in Sage BC Vision. In order to use Mail Merge, Custom Park must be installed. Custom Park is an add-on program and it is included in the Client Server Edition by default. If you are using Standard Edition or Small Business Edition, a Custom Park license is required to install Custom Park. Custom Park is not available in Limited Edition. Once the custom pack is installed, you need to enable email merge in system setup. I'm going to use the ABC Electronics company for my demonstration. To enable the custom pack in the system setup, everyone must be out of business vision. Then you go to utilities, system manager, system setup. Click Yes to the prompt, select Company, select Custom Park, activate Custom Park and select the option for Mail Merge. Click Apply, then click OK. Next, we need to grant the access to the user to the Mail Merge function. To do that, you go to Utilities, System Manager, user details click OK to the warning select the user click settings open the custom pack and make sure the mail merge option is turned on once you have that go to utilities and the mail merge is available for you to use You can create a letter that merges the data in the customer list, or the vendor list, or the employee list in BC Vision. In this example, I'm going to send this letter to everyone in my customer list. Before I do that, I have to create a template for my letter. In order to use that, you will need to have Microsoft Word installed on your machine. On the mail merge screen, you can merge with the customer list the vendor list or the employee list. You can select a range of customer, vendor or employee or you can select all. But first of all, we need a template for the letter. If you already have a template, you can select the template. If not, you can create new template by clicking on the new button. Microsoft Word will open and this one is the Windows where it shows all of the merge field that you can merge with the template. To insert a field, you can highlight the field and click insert. For example, I want the company name here. So I go to the location that I want to insert the field, highlight the name, click insert. Another way to do that is just double click on the field. You can close the window and you can always bring it back by clicking on the BV icon here. So I'm going to close it for now. And I want to add the contact person, so I bring the window back. Select the contact name, insert. After finish the template, I'm going to save the file. So go to File on the menu, click Save. By default, Business Vision will save it in the template folder under the Business Vision folder. You see the extension of the file is CMT. Please do not change the extension. If you merge with the supplier, the extension will be SMT, and if you merge with employee, the extension will be EMT. So I'm going to save it. I go back to the, cust the business vision and select the template that I just created, customer letter. 
you can send the letter to either Microsoft Office or go to the printer directly or go to the email. For this example, I'm going to send it to Microsoft Word, so I click OK. Microsoft Word will open and I have 34 records of customer in my file and here I'm going to have 34 letters to the customer and the first one is for Ace Electronics my second letter is for Acme Electronics so each letter will be on one page if you select the printer option the letter will be sent directly to your default printer if you select the email option you can send the letter to one of the four email addresses the main email or the contact number one number two or number three email you can enter the subject of the email if you select the option to send as an attachment the letter will be sent as an attachment if you don't select this option the letter will be in the body of your email so I'm going to send to one customer only this is the security message from Outlook so please select yes to allow the message to be sent and you will have a message saying one email address has been processed please check your outbox to see the status of these messages so let's open Outlook and in the outbox this is the email that we want to send out and you can see the letter in the body of the email You can choose the second level of selection criteria in the filter tab. For example, I want to send this letter to everyone in my customer list, but only those who are in Ontario province. So I'm going to send the letter to Microsoft Word, select all the customer, and then go to the filter tab. Select the customer where the province is equal to Ontario. Depend on the records that you want to merge, you can have some more selection criteria down here. You can select or deselect the option and once you finish, you click on the set filter button, then go back to the general tab, click OK. These are the letters to my customer list, but as you can see, only the customer in Ontario will be merged. This is the end of the video on how to use mail merge in Sage Business Vision. If you have any questions, please contact the customer support department at 800-215-5395.